The Jimmy Z Show. All right, next up, as we continue with more, Jimmy Z Show. Rapid fire. Wait a minute. That's too early. Rapid fire news and commentary. Oh, yeah. Here's a story about Michelle Obama. (laughs) Uh, This is at cnsnews.com. Dated just a couple of days ago. Unbelievable. The first lady says, imagine an America where kids beg for more fruits and vegetables. What planet does she live on? (laughs) God. Oh, that's so funny. What a moron. First Lady Michelle Obama said she can imagine an America where businesses promote the helliest, that's a um, Freudian slip there. Anyway, Michelle Obama says she can imagine an America where businesses promote the healthiest options. So children would be begging and pleading for fruits and vegetables, adding that it is possible to create such a world. Mommy, mommy, we're hungry. We'd like some celery. Can we have more broccoli, please? (laughs) We love Brussels sprouts. (laughs) Yeah, right. Michelle Obama is a big hypocrite. She married Barack and had two little kids. What she likes And has a big white ass But she wants to tell us what to eat With the law that she got passed Imagine our kids begging and pleading Throwing tantrums To get you to buy more fruits, vegetables, and whole grains Yes, this is possible Hey, the people in the background there The people in the audience They're not laughing for no reason They're laughing because it's absurd Mommy, mommy, could we have more lima beans, please? I'll bet you, I'll just bet you that uh, Michelle and Barack Obama's two daughters are not asking for lima beans. They're probably asking for Reese's peanut butter cups. My chocolate is in my peanut butter. It's doggone good. You get two great tastes and one candy bar. Reese's peanut butter cup. Real milk chocolate. Delicious peanut butter. Two great tastes that taste great together. (laughs) Reese's or Reese's Crunchy. Topped with chopped peanuts. Michelle Obama is a big hypocrite. Being the first lady. such ugly clothes that make her look real bad and her attitude is terrible because she's always very mad it is possible to create this world with more information Responsible marketing with better labels and product placement with greater access and affordability. Yeah, that's what's possible. Uh, With more government regulations and more rules from me, Michelle Obama. And uh, she mentioned labels like we don't have a big enough nutrition label on the back of all the products we buy already. We got to have more, bigger labels, better labels. And uh, what did she say in the first part of that clip? Hang on a second. Imagine our kids begging and pleading, throwing tantrums to get you to buy more fruits, vegetables, and whole grains. Yes, this is possible. Yeah, right. You're going to have kids throwing tantrums for tomatoes. (laughs) We want more tomatoes, Mom. Oh, God. You know what? You can't even get most kids to eat a salad, much less plead for it. Please, Mom, I want a bigger salad. Forget the fried chicken. I want a salad. All right. That's um, that's Michelle Obama. Michelle Obama is a big hypocrite. split a full 
chicken, some fries, barbecue ribs, and four corn on the cobs. Amazing how this liberal snob can be such a slob. All right, that's from my song, The Ballad of Michelle Obama. I've got the um, the YouTube link for that whole song if you want to hear it, and that'll be in the show notes. Um, here's some audio of Diane Feinstein saying something really stupid. Not that that's especially rare, but this is a really cool piece of audio. Very funny. Uh, well, it's not really that funny because this woman is trying to ban guns. So I want you to hear what she says here. It's uh, it's freaking ridiculous. Time has come, America, to step up and ban these weapons. The other very important part of this bill is to ban large capacity ammunition feeding devices, those that hold over 10 rounds. We have federal regulations and state laws that prohibit hunting ducks with more than three rounds, and yet it's legal to hunt humans with 15 round, 30 round, even 150 round magazines. Yes, you just heard a United States Senator, Dianne Feinstein from the formerly great state of California, say that it is currently legal to hunt humans. It's legal to hunt humans. Well, I guess Christopher Dorner didn't know that. There was no reason for him to fear the police at all because it's legal to hunt human beings, according to Diane Feinstein. We have federal regulations and state laws that prohibit hunting ducks with more than three rounds, and yet it's legal to hunt humans. Now, that's really something. You know, I think Diane Feinstein is senile. I think she might have Alzheimer's or something. There's something very wrong with anyone especially someone who's in office, who's in public office in the U.S. Congress, who would say that it's legal to hunt human beings. So I will dedicate one of my favorite pieces of audio to Diane Feinstein today on Monday, March 11th, 2013. Diane Feinstein gets the stupid montage. Idiot, moron, pissant, numbskull, dolt, blockhead, tool, twit, clown, bonehead, clod, dunce, nitwit, nincompoop, imbecile, boob, meathead, simpleton, lame brain, dodo, lunkhead. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> uh, that's for Diane Feinstein. <laughs>